Hey guys, it's Wolf of Valhalla Gaming, and we are back with Stormworks Build and Rescue, our Coast Guard Simulator, and we have decided to do a career mode, which is probably going to come back and bite me in the butt, because I don't know what I'm doing at all still. So, let's see what's going on here. This is our starter house, I guess. Mm, not too much going on. Oh, there's a, there's a wardrobe. Oh, we can change our clothes in there. I didn't know that. And we have a ship in a bottle. Okay, so let's see what our mission is currently. Capture seawater sample. Hmm. Get the sample to the crew. Okay, I guess we'll do that one. So, ah. Let's go. As always, hope y'all are enjoying the series. If you are, go ahead and like and subscribe down below. And if you'd like to see more content or content updates, go ahead and follow any of that social media. That'll be linked down below as well. So let's see what's going on here. Workbench. Ooh, no. Wants me to build a boat. Alright, I'm going to build a boat and we will be back in a moment. Alright, we are back, and we have taken the starter boat, which you didn't really get to see. It's a little white boat, and about five foot long. And we have extended it into a decent little work boat, I think. We'll see how well she handles in the water. So let's go ahead and spawn her in. Oh, there we go. Let's uh, see how this goes. And made it. Let's get in here. Engine works, throttle works, and our logic works. Alright, looks like we have a ways to go. That's 2.3 clicks out. So, I will see y'all when we get there. Alrighty, and we have made it. Oh, and I'm in the water. <laughs> so let's see what we have to do here. If I could climb this ladder maybe? Oh, that works. Good enough for me. Oh, that's the wrong button. I meant to tab, not F1. There we go. So let's see what's going on up here at this research facility, shall we? That's a nice turbine. It reminds me of the ones on Cliff Empire that we play with. Oh no. What is this? I'm supposed to get this in my boat? And what am I supposed to do with it? Also, only got like 29 more minutes to do this. What am I supposed to do with this? So I've got the handle. Do I just have to dump it in the water? <laughs> I mean, this is seawater, isn't it? Eh. What am I doing? What am I doing? Did I drop it? I dropped it. It got stuck. We're just going to throw this in the water. Maybe. Oh, that's all it required, really? So we're going to... Oh, it's dragging me under. This is a little ridiculous. Can I get up? How heavy is this thing? Oh, no. This thing's gonna drag me under. Let's try and get up on the rocks over here. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Physics in this game are still not that great. Oh yeah, she's definitely going down. Um, how do we even... Is there a release button, maybe? Let's... Tether handle. Pull it up to the surface here. I assume it's just gotten heavier with what we had on it. And we're going to try and get... Okay. Come on. Come on. Get on the rocks. Why? Uh, why do these games have to fight me so? Come on, you stupid research container. Ugh. Let's see if this incline is not as steep, maybe? Okay. 
We have our research container on dry land. Let's get this back to the research facility. Maybe. If we can find a pathway. This game is going to be the death of me, I swear. Can we please get... Alright, so release it. Is there a button? Oh, that's a connector. We could have just... <sighs> we did this the hard way. Could have just tied it to the back of a boat. Or winched it up somehow, but we don't have any winches. No, not into the water. Alright, so I'm going to try and figure out how to get this up before we fail it, and uh, I'll see y'all in a few minutes. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we managed to get the research sample back onto a road, and we're just struggling to lift it now. And can we get there? Can we get there? Can we get there? Hey, we did it. So what did we get? We got a winch. That would have been useful. Two research points and $1,500 in cash. All right. So in career mode, you can buy islands to build bigger stuff. That's pretty much how you build bigger stuff. So I'm not sure how much cash I have or even how to use everything just yet, but we're going to figure it out together. Let's not throttle into the thing. Start our engine. Uh-oh. Um, we're going to have to use the boat. Maybe. Maybe this is not good. I should have put a reverse on here. Why didn't I think of reverse? Oh, wait. Can I reverse? I wonder. Me. Throttle all the way down. Does S key still work for reverse like it does on the normal one? No? Okay. So we have to throttle. Oof, this is going to be ugly. Smack it against the dock here. Or we can throttle down and I can probably push it. Let's get out and try and push it. Can I push the nose? Okay, we can just rotate it that way. Good thing sharks aren't turned on. So sadly, on normal mode, you can't really... If you want the tutorial, which for some reason didn't come up anyway, you can't put sharks and NPC damage on, which is kind of sad. I'll try and change it later. Maybe we'll start a different career mode where I can actually die. And where my vehicles can actually be destroyed by doing this kind of stuff. Come on. Come on. Come on. Uh, I think that should be enough room for a... Uh, rotation there. Let's get in our pilot seat. Engines on. Throttled up. And we're going to start heading home. But as we head home, we're going to look at the map and see what islands are for sale. We have 42 grand right now. Um, it's only 10,000. What does it have? Do I have to go to these islands? What does this island have? Hmm... That one's for sale for a hundred thousand, jeez. So this is Coast Guard Outpost TT, and this doesn't have a name. But what is it? It says it's for sale. How do you buy it? Missions, map, research. Ooh, available. Basic logic, mechanics, buttons, decorations, displays, doors. Hmm. Sensors. Rescue equipment. Large boats. Yes. Land vehicles. Helicopters. Okay, so we'll research basic logic. And that's going to take a long time, apparently. Let's center back on the player. So this was that's done. So no longer need to make that our basic mission or mission. I don't know how to buy these islands. I'm gonna go to this island and try and buy it, I suppose. Hmm. 
This is gonna take forever to get there in this little boat. This thing is so slow. I mean, I like my little boat, don't get me wrong, but it's so slow. The water effects in this game are really nice too. Like, for a game that was designed this way, it's a really fun game. And it just looks really nice. 1.2 clicks left. Oh, jeez. 1,200 meters. Okay. We can do this, people. We can do this. So, hmm. I'm very curious to see how we buy islands. So there's Home Island over there. But we need to expand our operations because we need a bigger vehicle. This little boat is just not cutting it for speed of what we need. We have a need, a mighty need for speed. And the sun, that sunrise actually looks really good. As somebody who's worked on boats before, that, that brings back memories. The game is really beautiful for how it's designed. Oh, yeah, there we go. So if y'all have any suggestions for any other games y'all would like to see me play, go ahead and leave that down in the comments below. This was a suggestion, and honestly, I'm in love with it. Uh, somebody suggested Cliff Empire. I played a little bit of it, but... Not Cliff Empire. Apex Legends. I've been playing crap out of Cliff Empire. But I'm not too good at Apex Legends, so we will probably never see the light of day of that one. Oh, looks like we're only 500 meters out. Getting closer. Oh, it's got a actual light. Does my other one have a lighthouse on it? I don't think our island has a lighthouse on it. Where's the dock at, though? These islands are, like, super rocky, and it's really annoying. I can't wait to unlock helicopters. That's going to be a disaster. Speaking of disasters, how's our research doing? It's been one minute. Are you kidding me? It's actual time. Oh no. <laughs> Ladies and trolls, we may be in for a while. Oh no, I have to turn around. It is apparently the coast fort's on the other side of this. Okay. So let's pull a Yui. Go through this nice archway right here. There we go. At least it's really calm seas. I built the boat bigger than the starter one just because uh, I did do like a campaign mission with the starter boat before I decided to film this. And that little thing got rolled constantly by waves. And I'm sure this wouldn't do much better, but it offers a slightly more stable platform for larger waves. Especially in deep water. Okay, so this is a helicopter. Is that all this is? is? A helicopter and a slipway? I don't know how I feel about that. As much as I would just like to have a helicopter, we have to wait an hour and a half for basic logic right now. Alright, so let's go to this island. And I will see y'all... How far is it? 1.6 clicks? I'll see y'all when we get there. Ladies and gentlemen, we have made it, and it looks like it has a lot larger for a dock area, so we're going to throttle this down, try and bring this in near the stairs over here. We need a bigger boat. 
And maybe we can make these the lifeboats or something. Alright, let's kill the engine. Get out. And let's see about buying an eye. It's got a crane on it, too. Bet. Let's see how all this goes. So how do we buy it? Purchase island to use, but how do we purchase the island? Is there like a special... How do I purchase the island? I just want to purchase the island. Oh, do I have to walk up to this? Island for sale. Are you sure you want to purchase this island? Yes. We have an island now. And this is our new office? Ooh, nice, very nice. Where's our house? Where do we sleep? Oh, we got an upgrade, ladies and gentlemen. We have an upgrade. Though we don't have a wardrobe in here, unless it's the lockers over here. Huh. Can't open the lockers. No, but we can open everything. This is awesome. This is our new island, and I get to build bigger boats now. Much, much bigger boats. Can we use the crane? Oh, you're kidding me. We can use the crane, which means we can build land vehicles and load the land vehicle on the boat. Oh, yes. I'm going to try and pick up our boat. <laughs> it needs to be safely on shore so it doesn't run away. How do we do this? Track this way. This is the most dangerous thing I've done. <laughs> I'm going to sink a boat. Oh, this is the slowest thing ever. All right, so let's right slightly. Crane out. What does that actually do? Cable down. So let's see where our cable's at. So let's go crane out. Not sure what that is doing. Oh, it's lowering it. Okay. So let's crane fully extend until it won't anymore. Okay, so we're still going to have to do right, track forward a little bit. We're going to pull this boat up on shore so it doesn't fly away with the wind. And then off screen, I'm probably going to try and make a new rescue boat since we have a larger dock now. Alright, that should be good. Just need to rotate right. Ooh, that's, that's shaky. Let's go a little bit more to the right and start lowering that cable. We may have to pull that boat forward just a little bit in order to do this. Yes, we are. So we're going to get out, and we're going to push this boat forward just a little bit so we can pick it up by the cab of the boat. A little bit more. And this is going to be the base of our new operations. Once I get some bigger boats. Come on. Just need you to go a little bit that way. Alright, that should be good. Yeah, perfect. We'll just drop that magnet on it. Oh, I can do it from right here? Where's cable down? Magnet is on. Not sure if, so it didn't actually, it's not actually picking it up. <laughs> Is it just short of actually hitting it? Oh no, it's like two inches too short. Okay. Very well. We'll put you back. And then I'm probably going to try and work on a boat. 
Because we have no more missions right now. Slowest crane ever. <laughs> this makes me so happy that I have a crane, though. Because now we can pick trucks up and stuff and put them on our boats. Alright, so let's... Where's the workshop? Here's the workbench. Let's see how big... Oh, we have such a big... Oh, my gosh. So let's load our first boat. That is so oh, small compared to what we can build now. Yes. This is going to be a fun time, ladies and gentlemen. A very, very fun time. And let's see. But before I do that, do I have any... I have a lot of boats that I'm sure would already fit here. I'm just not sure if I trust myself with these types of craft yet. And plus all these pre-made boats were made in creative, so um, they have parts that I haven't unlocked yet. I do love catamarans though. Maybe I'll build something similar to this. Hmm. Ideas for later. Ideas for later. Let's exit that. For now, we have our baby boat. Is this a refueling line? It's a refueling line. What? What else can we do here? Oh, that was the wrong button again. I gotta stop hitting... Is that a tab? We have more lights. This is awesome. I love this. So I'm going to work on a boat for a little bit, and if I can get one done, I will see y'all with it. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, so I've been busy for a little bit. This is just the work in progress version, but we're going to test it out. This is going to be the NLR Midnight. Let's see. Engine should work. We'll throttle her up. Oh god, my, my reverse. Okay, my controls are backwards right now. That's fine. We can fix that. Let's try not to wreck it right now. Oh no. We, we've made it up. Uh-oh. <laughs> we, we, there were mistakes that were made here. That's fine. We can return her to the workbench real quick. Go to our logic. And I don't... I think it was actually my logic that was messed up. I think I just had these flipped upside down. So we'll delete those real quick. A, oh boy, I've got to remember how these rudders are supposed to go. So is this a minus? Okay, so yeah. So let me try and get these back in place real quick as they should have been. So plus, so that needs to be flipped. So plus needs to be on the right and minus needs to be on the left. I hate trying to do this sometimes. So plus on the right, minus on the left. Plus on the right, minus on the left. Plus on the right, minus on the left. Now we go to logic. We hook up our inputs here from AD to our rudders. There we go. And we're gonna save it just in case. Let's just nickname the cat one right now as the catamaran one. And we're gonna spawn it in. And there she is. This will probably end up being a trimaran once I'm done, but for now it's just a catamaran. So let's start the engine up. Are we going the right way this time? Hey, we got it. We've built our first boat. Kind of. It doesn't have a cab or anything yet, but you know. One small victory at a time, right? 
one small victory at a time. This is so fun. I love this. I love absolutely everything about this. So, we have done a lot today. We figured out how to get a water sample with that ridiculously annoying piece of equipment that they had. We bought an island and we built a new boat, which I'm probably about to wreck right now. Let's not wreck this one second. Oh, toggle the engine off. Hit the wrong button. Oops. Really interesting being able to control the uh, throttle without being in the pilot seat. Okay, well, thank y'all for joining me, and I will see y'all next time. Bye, guys.